Tim Hensel here with the Urban Homestead. Our website is www.oldvaapples.com. I want to give a quick uh, talk on some of the work that we're doing in our off season. Uh, we can't do some of our fruit tree work, so we're filling our time doing some uh, woodwork and a little bit of uh, artwork that we'll talk about here in a moment. But our first thing here is a chest that Aiden has done. Uh, here's Aiden, and this is all his work. I, 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 we gave a first run on this thing. I said it was mostly his work, but it's all his work. Uh, I believe we could say, and uh, he's done this thing from salvaged uh, pallet wood. You can see here's a piece of pallet wood on the bottom, it's got branding and scalloping, and uh, he had to disassemble the pallets completely. Sometimes you can work with a piece of pallet and, it'll, and use the basic structure, but he started here with this, uh, with this two by more or less a two by four, and put four of those together. Then came with these uprights here on the uh, sides on the corners. Here we have four uprights, and with the uh, with these uprights, then he was able to uh, on this long side he put this these strips of pallet wood on the inside of the two by fours, and here he put the pallet wood on the outside of the two by fours, and it ended up giving it a really nice uh, structure, two tones or even three or four tones here in the wood. That's one of the nice effects of this pallet. He sanded this down so it's pretty smooth and uh, gives a really nice effect, a, a weathered, salvaged effect, I suppose. And then the top was uh, put together from tongue and groove wood. We had some, some uh, pieces of that. Here's a little bit more pallet wood that happened to be, this was already shaped like this, so it fit perfectly here. And then some leather strapping to keep this thing from falling back on little Junior's head when he's uh, playing. And so, uh, this has turned out to be a really nice piece. He's not finished it yet. It's a, this is actually a gift for someone, and, and that person may want to finish the piece. So, uh, uh, coffee table, um, storage, uh, storage uh, container, uh, trunk, uh, really a fine piece. And Aiden's conceived that and put it together as well. And now we'll talk about uh, another uh, piece of uh, work that we've been doing. And I'm going to come here, cross over, and uh, this is a mosaic that uh, I teach a class of, from, of American literature. And uh, it's been actually a year ago that uh, students were working on these pieces. We took a, took a book uh, cover and cut it into, into small pieces and then it was the uh, responsibility of the student to take each little square and enlarge these squares. And so it's, it's the work of many people, and that's part of the effect of this thing. The, uh, there are different colors throughout it, and it creates a very nice uh, effect. Well, um, some of the students uh, didn't quite get all their pieces done, and some of them we thought maybe were not done the best. Here's a pink, uh, St. Lincoln was given some pink hair here. We never not, couldn't quite figure that, but we let that one go. And so uh, we shelved this thing for a while. It was, we didn't have the pieces, so we had to just uh, wait. But uh, Eli here uh, has worked on a lot of these pieces. Aiden has done a number of them as well, but I believe Eli did the bulk of these to finish this piece. And about three weeks ago, then we put the, uh, we laid these things out on the table, we had them numbered, and uh, glued them down here, and we happened to have a, a frame here that, uh, that uh, set this thing off very nicely. And so uh, Lincoln said, uh, after, I, after I separated from my father, I studied English grammar so as to speak and write as well as I do now. That's, that's why he ended up being the uh, featured man here in this uh, American literature class. And now we have, uh, we had a mirror up here above our mantle, but uh, now we have, uh, we have Mr. Lincoln taking the place of the mirror, and uh, we're very pleased with, uh, with the effect of this thing. And so uh, just a little update on uh, how we've been fill filling some of our off season. It's Tim Hensley. Urban Homestead, our website is www.oldvaapples.com.